Hello, this is the founder and CEO of Anthelion School of Art, Dipayan Banerjee. And this particular video is a video instruction for the music and painting fusion workshop that Anthelion School of Art is going to bring to you in your near future. So uh, the idea is that through this video, we are trying to tell you that what exactly you are going to experience on that day. So music and art fusion workshop is basically a, a process where you listen to music and whatever emotions you get, you, you express it in a piece of painting. Uh, you may have a prior experience of art, you may not, but that really doesn't matter. What is important to this whole thing is that you are able to, uh, you know, express your feelings, your thoughts that comes out by, by listening to that particular piece of music into that uh, art into into art so our mentors and guides will help you through the process and it is going to be an amazing experience for you uh, the actual process that will happen is uh, you know uh, shown by one of the senior artists of Kolkata Mr. Anjan Bhattacharya after uh, this uh, small piece of mine uh, then the rest of the video is his instruction you please watch this video it will hardly take you 10 to 12 minutes and once that is done uh, you please select your song the song must might be reaching you before the actual event listen to the song uh, four five times and whatever feelings or visualizations you get put it on a normal a4 piece of paper through pencil if you can use color fine if you cannot that also absolutely fine and uh, thereafter you just uh, you know bring that paper uh, on that day and uh, for the rest uh, listen to this video and once it is done check out your song and i'm sure you're going to have a great day on that uh, particular event uh, we'll see you there thank you hello everybody we are now talking about the compositions of painting actually uh, composition is a very simple thing but the most important part of painting when the images are being mingled together when are then there is a relationship between the images of, of the objects that creates a composition but it can be influenced by uh, different things you know it can be influenced from the nature you can be influenced to create your compositions from poetry and even from music and music is a very important uh, object through which you can create a nice composition. For example, a, a music itself can create pathos within your mind. It can create, create something joy, joyful, uh, uh, I mean, uh, experience or in feelings within your minds. And that particular feelings, when you are depicting on a space or a canvas, that is called composition when it is being properly placed. Uh, so let us take a let us take a, uh, an example uh, from a song Kai Dur Jab Din Jal Jai from Anand. It is a very famous song, and it it can be in uh, uh, I mean placed in two ways. It can be a poster of that particular song, or it can be a painting, exactly a painting from the feelings which you have got from that particular song. Let us do uh, something with that song, and let us see what comes out. कहीं दूर जब दिन ढल जाए सांझ की दुल्हन बदन चुराए चुप कैसे आए कहीं दूर जब दिन ढल जाए सांझ की दुल्हन बदन चुराए चुप कैसे आए मेरे ख्यालों के आंगन में कोई सपनों के दीप जलाए दीप जलाए कहीं दूर जब दिन ढल जाए सांझ की दुल्हन बदन चुराए now let us let us create some uh, uh, drawing so that we can have a base on which we can create the painting.
intentionally the lines are being made in such a way so that they are not straight. Intentionally these curved lines are being made. So this is the basic drawing. It is not very important to make the drawings totally, but you just have to have a layout. Now we are going to put colors on it. Now for, for doing this painting, I have taken black, I have taken cobalt blue, little bit of orange, bansana, Indian red, ochre yellow, white, lemon yellow, and uh, a little bit of, uh, I mean, uh, this is called, uh, this is called uh, raw yellow. So, let us start with the coloring. In the brush, I am putting colors, and according to that, it will move around. People, those who don't have, I mean, uh, uh, the experience of doing paintings or colorings, don't worry about it because during the workshop, we will be there to help you out. So that is not a problem. You just have a look at the painting I'm making. So you can have a nice idea what you have to uh, do or what you can do. now actually what I am doing, I am dealing with the setting sun. So the sun is setting and within a within a face actually it is it is just depicting the setting of the of the time, the setting of the of the sun. It's representing the setting of the time in the life of that particular person who, whom I am drawing, who I am making as a as a as a subject to bring out the feelings of the paintings. As you can see, the, the uh, sun itself is at the forehead of this particular face. So it is not a face; it is actually the life of of a, of a human being. So de depicting as a face, as if the time has gone out, the eyes are closed. The lower part will be darker because it will be taken as a water. So let us make a dark thing, then, then the reflections of the light of the setting sun will come over here. So act I'm trying the face as realistic as possible, but intentionally I'm disturbing some of the part of it so that it can smudge into the in, in such a way so that it looks like also. Now you can see that gradually the painting is coming towards its end. So as if the sun is setting and that effect of the setting sun is it can be, uh, I mean, it can be seen in the face of this particular. I have told before, this is not a human being, this is nature itself. So, if, now if you, if you, if you want to match this particular painting with that particular song that have, we have talked about, you can, you can see that I have done the painting. I have, haven't done the, uh, uh, the poster of that particular uh, music. And if you go through the lines of those, that particular beautiful songs, 
perhaps you will get the essence of that lines within this particular painting and that is that is what painting is it is not the poster it is the impression of my mind what is coming out of those lines and i am putting it on the on the canvas as a painting This is this is the final, uh, I mean, uh, representation of that particular song. As I have thought about it, I, as I have felt about it, on the lines as well as the color schemes. So this is the impression of uh, of the of the paint of the song as it has been expressed in this particular canvas. So while you will get your song, but maybe my suggestion is that listen the song for a number of times, at least three to four times, get into deeper part of it, try to get it in your mind and from there what is coming within your mind as an impression, try to draw it on a piece of paper, it can be rectangular, it can be square. So if you do this, it will be easier for you to continue when we will start the program on that particular day and later on we will carry you out to the final destinations of your paintings. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. 